more than into music, Caleb became into the Lord. I've never thought of Caleb as having so much of a past as a guy that discovered who he was really and began to grow in that, especially in ministry settings. Caleb draws people into the presence of God. I told Caleb this as we were talking. I said, look, God is always redemptive. He always brings things full circle in our lives. And he doesn't waste a moment of, of anything that happens. Some of the things we look at and we think, well, I wish I didn't go through that, and well, I wish I didn't make that decision. But as I look at Caleb's life, I recognize God's redemptive purpose in a life. And the fact that God has used his musical background, his experience, his unique experience, his salvation moments here, his deliverance moments here, his time all over the world to express what God's given him as a gift, but then to come full circle and come back here to be a part of our ministry team here, um, it, it's so, it's such an evidence to me that it doesn't matter if you're 20 or 30 or 40 or 50 or 60 or 70, the Lord's always ready to, to come back full circle and to complete the loop in your life because he's known all along. He's had his hand on your life. Uh, he's had his hand on Caleb's life. And I could use him as a great example of the things that we want to encourage everybody. You know, you don't have to be a rock star to find redemption. You don't have to be somebody who is popular to find that full circle. I believe that's true and can happen in anybody's life who's submitted to the Lord.